Hello, hi friends. I am your purchase sir. Now I am going to discuss one easy, interesting and very useful topic in English that is syllable. Dear friends, syllable means swaradvani. Syllable means khagunita. Syllable means balli. Sir, it is all now kalti devi and anubhavudu. Very interesting topic it is. See here. A sound unit or a vowel sound is called a syllable. You stay easy it be? Yes. A sound unit is ratta vandu dhvani ghataka or a vowel sound atwa vandu swara dhvani. It is now English nali syllable yannu teve. Okay. Next point. One vowel sound is equal to one syllable. One swara dhvani one syllable. One shabda dhali yashtu swara dhvani gadirtta ve ashtu syllable. Anth now count maad vik aakta ve. How the? Next point. The number of syllables in a word depends on the number of vowel sounds in it. One do shabda dhali yashtu syllable gali ve annu vantta dhu. A shabda dhali yashtu vowel sounds gali ve annu vantta dhu anna avalambi shirtta ve. Right? Next point. A vowel sound may be either a monophthong or a diphthong. A shabda dhali ru vantta vowel sound e nirtta dha adu monophthong agir bodu adwa diphthong agir bodu. Monophthong is one syllable. One diphthong is equal to one syllable. Vowel sound adu diphthong agir nu one day syllable. Monophthong agir nu one day syllable. Confusion ha. Monophthong agir nu single vowel sound is called monophthong. Diphthong agir nu Double vowel sound is called diphthong. Clear? Okay. Please note it down. I would like to share with you what are the monophthongs and diphthongs. Okay? Okay, students. Hope you have taken down the points. Now, let us see what are the monophthongs in English. Dear students, Monophthongs are also called pure vowel sounds. They are 12 in number. Okay. Pure vowels or monophthongs are same in meaning. Mono means one. Thong means sound. Got it? Yes. What are the monophthongs? See here. Number one. E. For example, meat. Second one, e. For example, mill. Third, a. For example, men. Fourth, pure vowel is, a. a. For example, man. Fifth one is. Ah, uh, for example, mark. Sixth monophthong is O. Oh. For example, mock. Seventh one is O. Oh. For example, morning. Eighth one is O. Oh. For example, pull. Ninth one is O. Oh. For example, moon. Tenth one is a. For example, mount. Eleventh one is a. For example, murky. Twelfth monophthong is a. For example, much. This is strong a. Got it? Next, diphthongs. Diphthongs are vowel glides. They are made up of two vowel sounds. Two pure vowels will make one diphthong. In simple words, we can say 
single vowel sounds are called monophthongs and double vowel sounds are called diphthongs clear let us see how many diphthongs are there in english they are eight in number okay let us see first one a e a for example mail may il kurshali mail in india is in a and b india only but in english we have to say may il may got it second one a e i for example mile mile third one is o e oi for example koi ko il koi okay fourth one is a u au au for example count kha und kha und count okay this form one syllable fifth one a u o a u o o for example ma ul maul maul in india we pronounce it as o clear and fourth one in india we pronounce o o but in english we have to pronounce au this is the basic difference wherever we pronounce au in english we have to pronounce it as au where we pronounce o there we have to pronounce au au okay sixth diphthong is ear for example mia mia me a me a seventh one is u a u a u a for example poor poor last diphthong is a a a a a a a for example care in india we pronounce it as a care and tv now care day and tv day don't say sunday just say sunday sunday okay dear friends there are 12 monophthongs and 8 diphthongs all together in english language we have 20 vowel sounds sir now either kalthuri au aid in kalthire au vowel sounds already au vowel letters re a e i o u they are vowel letters these are vowel sounds hope it is clear okay please take down i'll give you some examples okay okay students how you taken all the vowel sounds in english yes now let us see some examples in which how syllable is counted are you ready see here the first word school while counting the syllables one point bahal important new yava syllable count martiri vowel sound count madbeku vowel letters count madbardu consonant letters count madbardu ಆ ಶಬ್ದದಲ್ಲಿ ಎಷ್ಟೇ ವಾವಲ್ ಲೆಟರ್ಸ್ ಇರಲಿ ಎಷ್ಟೇ ಕಾನ್ಸೋನೆಂಟ್ ಲೆಟರ್ಸ್ ಇರಲಿ ಅದು ನಮಗೆ ಮುಖ್ಯ ಅಲ್ಲ ನಮಗೇನು ಮುಖ್ಯ ಅಂತಂದರೆ ಆ ಶಬ್ದದಲ್ಲಿ ಎಷ್ಟು ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ಸ್ಗಳಿವೆ ನೋಡಬೇಕು ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಚೇಂಜ್ ಆದರೆ ನಂಬರ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಸಿಲೆಬಲ್ ಚೇಂಜ್ ಆಗ್ತದೆ ಓಕೆ ಈ ಪಾಯಿಂಟ್ ಯಾವಾಗಲೂ ಮರಿಕೂಡೋದು ಹಾಂ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ನೋಡಿ ಸ್ಕೂಲ್ ಎಷ್ಟು ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಅದಾವ ರೀ ಒಂದೇ ಒಂದು ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಅದ school andre long vowel ada so this is a word of one syllable id nodi m a d e yerd vowel letter adavu yerd consonant adavu irli but yest vowel sound adavu re may id 
ಒಂದು ಡಿಫಾಂಗ್ ಅದ ಒನ್ ಡಿಫಾಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಮೇ ಇದ್ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಲಾಯ್ ಆಯ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ರೈಟ್ ಖಾವ್ ಆವ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಫಾಂಗ್ ಸೊ ಖಾವ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ಸ್ ಸರ್ ಒಂದೇ ವಾವ್ ಒಂದೇ ಒಂದು ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಅದ ರೀ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಬೌನ್ ಔ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ಡಿಫಾಂಗ್ ಡಿಫಾಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಸೊ ಬೌನ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಎಸ್ ಶ್ಯೂರ್ ಸಿ ಯು ಆರ್ ಇ ಡೌನ್ ಸೇ ಕುರಿ ಆರ್ ಕ್ಯೂರೆ ಲೈಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ನೌ ಶ್ಯೂರ್ ಓ ಓ ಇಸ್ ಒನ್ ಡಿಫಾಂಗ್ ಸೊ ಒನ್ ಡಿಫಾಂಗ್ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಇನ್ ದಿಸ್ ವರ್ಡ್ ಸೊ ಒನ್ ಡಿಫಾಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಶ್ಯೂರ್ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ದೇ ಸರ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಇ ಇ ಅ ಇ ಅ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ಡಿಫಾಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ಈಕ್ವಲ್ ಟು ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಹೇ ಹೇ ಅ ಹೇ ಅ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಸೇ ಎಚ್ ಎ ಆರ್ ಇ ಹಾರೆ ಆರ್ ಹರೇ ಕೆನ್ ಯು ಸೇ ನೋ ಹೇ ಏ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಒನ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಒನ್ ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಸೊ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಒನ್ ಸ್ಟ್ರಾಂಗ್ ಅ ಇಸ್ ದೇ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಒನ್ ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಸೊ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಟೂ ಟೂ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಠೀಚ್ ಠೀಚ್ ಲಾಂಗ್ ಈಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಯು ನೋ ಠೀಚ್ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಠೀಚ ಠೀಚ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಠೀಚ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಟೂ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಇಂಗ್ಲಿಷ್ ಇಂಗ್ ಒನ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಲಿಶ್ ಟೂ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಇಂಗ್ಲಿಷ್ ಇಂಗ್ಲಿಷ್ ಇಸ್ ಅ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಟೂ ಅವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ಸ್ ಟೂ ಸೂಟ್ ಟೂ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ದೇ ಅ ಗೌ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ಸ್ ಟೂ ಅವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ಸ್ ಟೂ ಟೂ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ದೇ ಅಮೌಂಟ್ ಅ ಆವ್ ಟೂ ಅವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ದೇ ಟೋ ಸೊ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಅ ವರ್ಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಟೂ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಅ ಖಾಂಟ್ ಅ ಆವ್ ಅ ಆವ್ ಟೂ ಅವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ಸ್ ಟೋ ಟೂ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಬಿ ಖಾಸ್ ಇ ಆ because how many syllables two syllables why because two vowel sounds are there idea idea i e idea two vowel sounds so we can say it's a word of two syllables any a e a e any it's a word of two vowel sounds so two syllables very 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 is the word of two syllables sorry sorry is the word of two syllables father fa a uh, a uh, uh. it's a word of two syllables accident accident how many syllables sir three syllables is it clear photograph photograph how many syllables three vowel sounds three syllables head master how many syllables three syllables how you got it now remarkable remarkable how many syllables sir four syllables accidental accidental how many syllables sir four syllables why four vowel sounds are there sir understand now examination e ya e a a examination how e ja me ne shan how many syllables five syllables right qualification ko li fi ke shan how many syllables five syllables vowel sound lekka madodre ಎಷ್ಟು ವಾವಲ್ ಸೌಂಡ್ ಅದ ಅಷ್ಟು ಸಿಲಬಲ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳೋದು ಯೂನಿವರ್ಸಿಟಿ ಯು ಇ ಅಿ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಫೈವ್ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಲಿಟ್ಲ್ ಓಕೆ ಲಿಟ್ಲ್ ಲಿಟಲ್ ಹೌ ಮೆನಿ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಟೂ ಸಿಲಬಲ್ಸ್ ಕೇಬಲ್ ಕೇಬಲ್ 
How many syllables? Two syllables. Nation. Nation. How many syllables? Two syllables. One interesting example. See here. Us. Us. How many syllables? One vowel sound. One syllable. A double S. Yes. How many syllables? One. Consonant letter hits together. Vowel sound hits together. Okay. L A double S. Lass. Means girl. Lass. How many vowel sounds? One vowel sound. So how many syllables? One syllable. Okay. Next. Class. Class. Again, how many syllables? Only one syllable. Why? Only one vowel sound is there. Next. C L A double S I C. Classic. Classic. How many syllables? Two vowel sounds. So two syllables. Okay. Next. Classic Al. Classical. Classic Al. How many syllables? Three syllables. Okay. Win. How many syllables? One. Window. Correct. Two syllables. Dear students, have you got some idea how to identify the number of syllables in a word? Yes. Are you happy? Yes. Dear students, thank you so much for watching this video till the end. And I'd like to meet you all with one more interesting video on one more topic next time. Till then, bye.